Welcome Snack Tackers, my name is Jason and I have another potentially fantastic product to review for you guys today. But first I want to remind you to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell, all the fun YouTube stuff. Now let's get to talking about this product. This is a new brand and a new product but not a new idea. These are these uh, uh, kind of protein packed balls but you know they're, they're like dates and all the sorts of things are the, what they're made out of but this is the brand Fruise Balls this is the peanut butter and jelly flavor that's right Fruise Balls I don't know there are three vegan energy balls uh, on the back there's a blurb which we'll read in a voice I'll decide as I'm reading things uh, the nutritional information three balls per serving uh, that's 170 calories it's good fiber not too bad sugar, kind of low protein. Tis what it is, tame what it isn't, as I always say. These were purchased from a Walmart for a dollar eighty-eight or forty-eight. Come on, Jason. I just told you to write better. I'm checking the other one now to see what the price is. Yes, there are two. A dollar forty-eight. It's $1.48. Um, here's the blurb, which we're gonna do. You know what? I don't think any of you guys have heard my Christopher Walken. So we're gonna do uh, this in a Christopher Walken voice for no particular reason. All the yum of a PB&J sandwich is infused into one little coconut covered in crata ball to keep your taste buds happy and your body too. Real fruit, tasty nuts, zero junk, fruit balls, funny name, serious plant power. Uh, infrused, so it's not saying what the infrused means. I'm s assuming it's fruit that's been infused. Inside, it looks like there's, again, a date outside with coconut on top and then PB&J on the inside. That's just what it looks like. Whoa, inside these are way bigger than I thought. It smells like PB&J. You know how much I love PB&J. However, it didn't say if it's strawberry jelly or grape. And so I'm going to have to assume that it's strawberry based on the pink that's everywhere. But if it's grape, that's going to be a bummer for me. Let's give this a try. Three, two, one. Snack attack. I think it's strawberry. That's really good. Mmm. Just tastes like peanut butter and jelly and coconut. Mmm. This is one of the better ones, honestly. It's probably because it's not actually like a protein bar. It's an energy ball, which means nothing. Honestly. It doesn't mean a thing. What's an energy ball? It's pretty good, though. And if you are looking for a mid-level calorie intake with some good flavor and plant-based, you can't go wrong. This is fantastic. Uh, it's a snack tech, yes, all the way. Out of 10, 9 out of 10. I know I'm being pretty generous here, but I told you I love PB&J, and this tastes like PB&J with a little bit of coconut, and I like coconut too, so... Sorry. Quest for Wacken approves. Wacken. It's been better. It's been worse too, but it's been better. Uh, the question we asked around here is not will the other uh, Fruz Ball be as good being not a peanut butter and jelly? I'm not telling you what it is. You gotta stay tuned for it. So tune in next Saturday. Is it a Saturday now? Hello, Sirens? Do you know if it is a Saturday? It's not, is it? And the next one won't be coming out on Saturday, will it? Who knows? No, it's Would You Buy It Again? And absolutely. If I'm looking for something mid-level caloric intake, for sure, I will get these. But remember, check Instagram, TikTok, all the fun social media stuff. 
and I'll see you in the next one.